Lane Kalexa, welcome back to my channel. I wanted to share with you guys how I achieved these super soft, hydrated, defined, shiny curls because my hair was super dry and a hot mess. So hopefully this routine can help you guys out. I'm pretty sure we've all been there where you get a little too heavy handed with product or it could be the weather outside. You just don't really have time to be washing your hair constantly and you get products build up. I had really dry hair and that was because all of the product that was in it basically created a barrier so it was not letting any moisture in to my hair. Thus leaving it very dry and so I definitely needed to clarify my hair and hydrate it. I decided to apply a little mixture of oil to my ends before doing this just to ensure that my hair doesn't get completely stripped of its oils and moisture. This is just a mix that I make at home. I love using avocado oil and almond oil. Next up, hop in the shower, rinse my hair, get it nice and damp, and then I started off with Diva Curls Wash Day Wonder. This product is really, really good for detangling your hair and sort of prepping it before you're going to clarify, shampoo, and all of that good stuff. So I applied a generous amount of this from my ends, working it up to my scalp. I then followed up with the Build Up Buster. This is basically a cleansing serum, and I focused this on my roots and my scalp, massaging it into my hair, making sure it was nice and saturated, and then I rinsed it all out of my hair. Of course, I really wanted to follow up with a good deep conditioning treatment so that my hair feels nice and hydrated and moisturized. This is a fave of mine I've been using a lot recently. It's from Camille Rose. This one has coconut water and it's their penetrating hair treatment. It smells really good. It's nice and creamy and moisturizing, but it's not like a super thick consistency. So I applied a generous amount of this all over my hair, always focusing on my ends because I tend to get a lot of split ends, so I have to be super careful on my ends, especially if I'm trying to grow out my hair. And then I added a little bit of the melt into moisture onto my ends. Now, these products you can leave in your hair for 5, 10, 15 minutes, 20 minutes, however you see fit. Or, if you're like me, you can leave them in for a couple of hours. Then, I rinse my hair with really cold water. It's gonna help cut down on frizz and it just leaves your hair super shiny. So that's the perfect prep to your styling products, which is the fun part for me. So, for this wash and go, I wanted to use these styling products from or I like starting off with a little bit of this as my leave-in. It's very similar to the Infusion that they sell at like Sally's and stuff like that. It just has some vitamins for your hair. So I add a little bit of that and then I start off with the Priming Lotion Leave-In Conditioner. I always love sectioning my hair when I'm going to apply my styling products because that way you're not too heavy-handed with the products and you make sure that you get even distribution. So starting from my ends, working my way up, and avoiding the scalp area because I love when my hair dries that it has volume so you don't want to put too much product on your scalp. After I applied the leave-in conditioner, I followed it with the styling buttercream. Now this styling cream is more on the heavy side. My hair does really well with like heavier, creamier products. If yours does not, then maybe you can skip to the Curl Control Silken Cream. This one has a lightweight consistency compared to the styling butter. I used both. <laughs> I layered it onto my hair, but just small amounts, starting at my ends, working my way up. And then, after all of those products, I topped it off with the Curl Gloss Hydration and Hold. Right now, I'm letting my hair air dry, but you can see that it is super defined. It looks really shiny. It feels soft. Of course, I'll come back when it's completely dry and show you guys the end and results. Those are all the products that I use to clarify my hair, give it a good deep conditioning session, and then style it. I hope you guys found this video helpful. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And if you're interested in content in Spanish, I have created a brand new channel that is dedicated to all of my Spanish videos called Canela con Risos. I'll have the link in the description box, so don't forget to follow along that one too. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.
Bye.